What is Alzheimer's disease? Alzheimer's disease is the most common cause of dementia and also the best understood. Alzheimer's disease is thought to be caused by the formation of abnormal deposits of protein in the brain. These are called plaques and tangles and they are made up of two key proteins, amyloid and tau. Amyloid and tau are present in healthy brains, but in Alzheimer's disease they function abnormally. Amyloid forms plaques outside cells and tau forms tangles inside them. These plaques and tangles damage the nerve cells, causing them to die. When lots of cells die, this causes the brain to shrink. In Alzheimer's disease, the hippocampus is usually one of the first areas of the brain to be affected. The hippocampus has a vital role in forming memories. So someone in the early stages of Alzheimer's disease will often have trouble forming new memories. They may struggle to remember what they have just done or said and may repeat themselves in conversation. More recent memories are usually lost first while older memories can remain for much longer. Someone may remember things from their childhood better than they do things from earlier that day, for example. This is because older memories from childhood depend less on the hippocampus and more on other parts of the brain, which are not damaged as early in Alzheimer's disease. In Alzheimer's disease, the amygdala is often affected later than the hippocampus. The amygdala plays an important role in emotion, which explains why a person with Alzheimer's may recall feelings or emotions about an event or person, even if they cannot recall the facts of the situation. As more and more nerve cells die and more areas of the brain are affected, the symptoms of Alzheimer's become worse and more numerous. This is sometimes known as a gradual progression of symptoms. The brain of a person with Alzheimer's disease also has lower levels of a certain neurotransmitter, which allows messages to pass between nerve cells. Lower levels of this chemical may cause the remaining cells to communicate with each other less effectively, leading to greater problems with memory and thinking. The main drug treatments for Alzheimer's disease aim to increase levels of this neurotransmitter in the remaining nerve cells, helping to preserve brain function for a while. As Alzheimer's disease progresses, it becomes much harder to remember things. People with the condition can be helped to find new ways to cope with memory loss. There are many simple memory strategies to do this. For example, to remember a pin number, it may help to imagine the numbers making a shape on the keypad. There are also various memory aids that can help, from simple things such as calendars or sticky notes, to more high-tech solutions such as electronic medication reminders. As Alzheimer's progresses, a person may have less control over their emotions and their ability to express them. It is important to understand this and try to see past how the person is behaving and work out how they are feeling. For example, a person with Alzheimer's disease may follow their carer around because they are in need of reassurance.